So that's three two open E, and then it's two one open A. Just like that. It's all downstrokes. This whole song is downstrokes. It shouldn't be too tough. Open E, second fret, fifth string, third fret to the second fret on the fourth string, open E to the second fret on the fifth string, to the fifth fret on the fourth string, then back to the three two on the fourth string, and that was open E to the second fret, fret fifth string, to the third fret on the fourth string. And that's an open fourth string. And that's third fret E string, sixth string, open fifth, open fourth. And then that's the first fret on the E sixth string, and then that's an open fourth string. Okay, then the, the riff obviously is the same thing with distortion after that. Okay, and then after that it comes out of that, comes in back into that opening riff. When you're doing those chuggas, it's the full power, it's the just the power chord, you know, the at least the bottom two strings. So it's basically the opening riff, except you're sliding it, and then you're popping off that in that lower E uh, six string uh, in between. And then in between you're doing an open E, and then, an o and then an F. Okay. Now the riff coming out of that sliding riff. It's slightly different than that. It's slightly different than that, even though it sounds very much like that. It goes like this. Okay? So it sounds like this. Okay, it... it, it every time that sliding riff comes into play, any outro out of that riff is that is the riff I just showed you. It's just subtly different than... So, I studied the record a million times and I can't believe I missed that, but I just caught it and that's how it goes. They play it like three times throughout the song, so no big deal. Okay, these are all open strings. O, 1, 2 on the E string to the 1st fret on the 5th string. It's all O, 1, 2. And 2, 1, O. Okay. All I'm doing is I'm just doing a little shake there on the second fret. And that's to the 012. And then that's the uh, fifth string first fret. And that's that open E power chord.
that was the uh, 01 2 to the open fourth string. And then you're going to land on the third fret power chord on the E string. And this is the verse, it's very simple. You're just going 01 2 with the shake and then to the open E. You're just, you know, every third or fourth, I think every fourth one, you're just gonna land on the third fret power chord. Whoops, screwed that up. So you can tell every time I go into that, you know, the main Harvester of Sorrow riff. Right before he just does that. That's an open E to an to the first fret. typical chorus to this song. Remember, that's the riff I showed you before. That's how it ends. That's how it comes out of the uh, chorus. Okay, that's that same riff in the beginning. It's probably my favorite riff on the whole album, actually. So that's remember 012 to the open fourth string at the end there. Okay, now let's go back. Let's go up to the. Uh, uh, I don't want to go to the solo because that stuff's easy. The rest of the song is very easy to figure out. Um, so let's come out of the solo. Riff from the opening. Okay, even I screwed that one up. So what you're gonna do is again it's that open to the open E to the first fret. That's kind of how they start these riffs. Okay, and uh, the first note is a open A, and you're going to kind of hammer on and pull off the first fret. And then it's going to go right to the third fret. Then an open fourth string. Okay. Okay, so it's open four string. So it's second fret once. So it's second fret once, third fret twice, fifth fret once, then up to the to the third string. You're gonna go second to third fret and shake that third fret. Okay. Like that, and then it's gonna go. And it's the same riff I just did, except instead of going, you're just gonna go to that second fret on the third string and back down to the fourth string on the third fret. And you're gonna shake that. 
you, then it's an F in between. Now is the uh, the quick little you know hand, uh, pull offs that they do. Okay, hold on, I gotta do this really quick. Okay, so it's you're going three two open. Just pick the string once on the third string. So it's hammer on pull off to the open string. So it's two, three, two, open. And then three, two, open on the fourth string. And then again, the E in between. Okay, nope, oh, that wasn't like that. So you can see on the second time you do that riff, it's just going up to the fifth string there. It's not going back to the fourth string. The whole thing is on the on the third string. And then it's going to the F. Okay, guys, that's really the whole song. So uh, uh, if you need to have any questions, let me know. But that's it.